single column and single row can do entire table scan let's learn that today hi there this is pinal dave and welcome all of you to another episode of sequel in the 60 second just other day during sequel server performance tuning consultation i encountered a very interesting question and i wanted to share that with you i noticed that my client is doing a single column single row read and they were confident that this query is extremely fast honestly they had a terabyte big table and that single column single row table was doing entire terabyte table scan it is totally possible and i'm going to show you that today let's go to sql server management studio on the screen i have simulated similar query with the help of sample database you can download this sample database by following instruction in the description field well now let's look at this query here it is first thing i have enable is set statistics io which is going to show us how much data it is going to read from database next i have query over here and the query says select column name from table and some condition let's execute this statement and here we can see a single column and single row when we look at execution plan it also looks pretty innocent but the real information is hidden over here under messages here we can clearly see that it is actually reading around 11994 pages size of each page is around 8k that means this is lot of data it is reading now let's go and run another query this is select star from table this is pretty much reading every single row from this table when we execute this query it's going to take a little bit while because it is displaying around 70500 plus rows now going to messages it is very clear that it is reading only 11400 pages that means we are reading much lesser amount of the data when we are retrieving all the rows from the table and we are reading more data when we are selecting only one column and one row from a table isn't this interesting now let's run both of these queries together upon execution of these queries we can see result over here click on execution plan and there we go we can see execution plan of both of this query is equivalent to each other next click on messages and over here you can see differences between logical read let's learn one more thing in this video now i will run the query on a top with single degree of parallelism when i execute both of them together this time the query on a top runs on single processor it also gives us missing index hint isn't execution plan fun and interesting every single day when i help my client with performance tuning i learn something new about query optimization and execution plan well that's it for today i'll see you soon in the next episode of sequel in the 60 second do not forget to like share and comment on this video i'm sure you have already subscribed to this channel correct